Okay, today is a uh, RGN or removable gooseneck job. So what I'm going to do is uh, tell you a little bit quick what how you do it. Then I'll set the the uh, camera down on a little tripod and watch and see how it's done. So it's got a, a hydraulic pack in there that runs on the gas engine. The levers are over there. What you do is the gooseneck is hung by these pins here, right? But inside here, in the center, you see that right there is a big lock. So it's basically just a big hook that hooks in there. So you set it down and lock in there and it can't come ahead. And then all the weight is held on these. How to get them off? Drop your air on both the truck and the trailer. Then you push on the cylinders, it raises the deck till there's space for these uh, shim legs to come clear. Once you've raised the deck that much, you swing your shim legs out of the way. Then you lower the deck and it just goes down, 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 down until it hits the ground. And when it's sitting on the ground, then you can, you're, you're free off of those and you can slide ahead. Don't forget to uh, disconnect your air and electric. And then there is a small hydraulic leg right there that pushes down, sits on the back of the frame there to hold the whole gooseneck thing hanging on the fifth wheel. So just floating there all by itself. That's how it's done. Now I'll set up the tripod and you can watch it and then we'll probably put it on fast speed to see what's actually going on. Okay, here goes nothing. Okay, I failed to mention one other thing. This yellow pin that I pulled, that's your lock pin. I got my, uh, there we are, got my camera in the, in the case. So, so that lock pin holds that thing from coming up. That's what locks it in, is down in the big old dog there. So now it's laying on the ground. I also tuck my hoses in there so you don't run them over. It's floating over there. Cut the support arm. So now I just pull away.
Hey, there it is laying there. So you can see it hooks onto the big pins and the centerpiece slides up and hooks into this big dog in here. So that's how it works. So now we'll load the rock truck when it gets here and then uh, back her back in. And it can sit and wait like that and then I just hook back right into it, pin it on and do the reverse. Okay, they brought the rock truck so now I'll load it on there. I'll get her straight and hopefully get her right. First try. Set up and back the truck in there, we can watch that and then tire all down. So it's as wide as the trailer, 10 wide trailer. If I could zoom out a bit, but I think that's it. They're a long ways up into those boxes, you can't even hardly jump and see. Anyway, now we'll hook up the trailer. Okay, I'm backed in close. You can see how uh, that, I got my stupid camera in the way, I can't see with the tripod. You see how that slide, it slides in there and then goes in past where this pin is, right? And then it'll lock in like that. And then these, I just slide them in and lock them. Well, slide it in, pin it, set the brakes, lift her all up. So now I'll set up the tripod and we'll watch that. I don't know the best angle, but we'll try that, I guess. Okay, it's set in against, it's down in, fire it up, and lift that thing into place. So there we have it. So now this thing here is locked. You can see that it's in the right place. It's pinned down. There on there. So we're good. I'll put the air back in the suspension, put the air back in the trailer, tie down the back of the thing, take my hoses that were getting, uh, tucked away there, and plug them back in, turn them back on. 
and she's ready to go. So there we are, using the RGN or the remo removable gooseneck trailer. That's how you do it. I've only done it a few times. I'm not some thousand load professional, but those are the steps. Well, here I am. Leaving the yard. That's kind of cool, huh? So now I'm an experienced uh, RGN removable gooseneck operator since I've used it more than one day now. Off we go home. It's almost supper time. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later.